Hey guys, what's up? This is Ash here from CurseForward.com and in this video, let's go ahead and uh, take a look at uh, the group play feature as well as the remote view finder. So, well, if you've seen Samsung's launch event, you'd know uh, about group play. So, this is, uh, what do you say, where you can share your music, pictures, documents and play games if you have two Samsung Galaxy S4s. Let's see how uh, how to get set up. So I've got a Galaxy S4 i9-500, the Exynos Octa-Core variant here, and uh, the Qualcomm Snapdragon variant. That's the i9-505 here. The first thing you need to do to set up group play is to hit create group on one of the phone, one of the phones. Give it a password. Let's keep it one, two, three. Keep it simple. Okay. Just open it up. All right, now select join group on the other Galaxy S4. And it will ask you for a password. So now if you enter it, it gets paired with this Galaxy S4. If you don't wanna do that, just leave this S4 as it is. Go to share music. Um, okay. And there you see, you don't have to enter a password. Uh, you can just, this, uh, what do you say? As you can see, you don't have to enter a password. Uh, you can get, you can initiate the connection via NFC, which is a big uh, plus. And you can control the audio levels of both phones. So, And as you can see right now, this is the left speaker and this is the right speaker. You can change that as well. You can, okay, I'm gonna make this the right speaker. And uh, make this the left speaker. All right, so now this is the left speaker and this is the right speaker. So just to show you guys again, All right, so that is uh, with regards to music sharing. Now going into share, share pictures. Okay, let me, you just need to select the, the pictures that you wanna share. Hit done. All right, once it's opened up, just put and tap this. Again, tap the, tap the backs. So now every picture you wanna show someone, it keeps, it, it automatically changes on their phone as well. Uh, one thing I noted is you uh, you, you can't actually zoom in and show someone something, but fair enough. You can you can still have them uh, watch the picture that you wanna. So you're 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 talking about your trip, you know, like this picture, this happened or whatever. So you can share it. Pretty cool. Same thing with documents, and you've got some games as well. So again, just open up the game. And uh, I just quit this first. Enough. That's it. So I can hit multiplayer.
and uh, you can get started. So guys, next let's take a look at the remote viewfinder functionality. So let me open up the camera, tap on the cog, hit share, select remote viewfinder. So now you've got two options, easily connect or Wi-Fi direct setting. So guys, I'm gonna select easily connect and I'm gonna place them back to back and now select touch to beam. So as you can see, both these phones are now, you know, getting connected. So this is going to be used as the remote viewfinder. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys a little bit. That is my PC. That's my desk there. Just the green screens I use for the ending of my videos. These are my lights. Um, that's the top. So as you can see, the remote viewfinder works really well and it's pretty easy to set up, unlike how it was with the Galaxy camera uh, and the S3 earlier on. Uh, so that's pretty much it. You know, I just want to do a quick little video of uh, the kind of features that you can, I mean, you can get when uh, you have a multi multiple Galaxy S4s or in a few months, once these features get pulled over to the S3 and the Note 2, I just want to, uh, and yeah guys, uh, these features that we were talking about right now, these will be ported over to the Galaxy S3 and the Galaxy Note 2 uh, once they receive their respective Android 4.2.2 updates. Uh, the Galaxy Note 1 and the S2 might see uh, partial, uh, partial ports because, you know, as you can see, these features do use NFC to initiate the connection and uh, the most popular variants of the S2 and the Note 1 do not come with NFC. So that's pretty much it for this video. Uh, what do you think about group play and uh, uh, the remote viewfinder? Do you think they're just gimmicks, or do you, do you actually think you could find a uh, you could find a use for it? So let me know in the comments section. And uh, once again, thanks a lot for watching. Hope you guys liked the video. And uh, if you guys have any video requests for me, or if you just want to stay updated on my latest videos and updates, you can hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, or Google Plus. All my contact details are in the description. So that's it for now. Thanks a lot for watching. This is Ashia from CurseForward.com signing off. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye now.